Sean, it was touch and go for a, a long time, but you've got there in the end, you're in the semi-finals. I suppose that's all that matters. Yeah, um, we started well, I think, but um, we let them back into the game and they're a strong side, so they really tested us and uh, it was down to the, to the last few minutes, really, but glad to be into semi-finals. The, the team just took the, the, the foot off the pedal very slightly at one stage and once Kingston got the momentum, it's just hard to get going again? Yeah, I think we got slightly complacent and um, let them back into the game and they're a good football inside, so they capitalised on their chances and I think we then couldn't regroup quick enough to get back and it took extra time for us to actually regroup and score the goal but I'm glad we're in the semi-final so it's all good. Once you got to then that stage it was so tight at that stage wasn't it did you yeah. think that one goal in the end was going to settle it? It was going to go either way I think um, and the girl missed the chance at the end but yeah. <laughs> could have could have gone to penalties but I think yeah either either side could have won it in extra time because that's the way the cup goes really but um, yeah. I was just going to ask you that. Was it heart and mouth time when that ball dropped to her way in front of goal? <laughs> and when Justine Norton hit the bar in the last yeah. minute in normal time? I thought Jess had scored, to be honest. But, um, yeah, when the when the um, ball fell to the girl, and I thought she'd put it away. But those things happen, I suppose, in the last minutes of games. But, um, yeah, Kate were unlucky today, I think. But I'm glad that we managed to pull the win out of the bag. And Sophie Domingo had a great game, scored two goals and created the winner for you. So yeah. what, what do you remember at the winning goal? I just remember getting the ball, playing it out wide and then just making a run into the box really and getting the set back and I just I just you don't really think in those moments, you just all I remember is just trying to slide side foot into the back of the net and thankfully it came off because they don't normally <laughs> go in for me but yeah, thankfully it did. How ironic for you to score here, coming back <laughs> to the West Country and scoring yeah. the winning goal. I suppose the script was written for you, wasn't yeah, it? Yeah, definitely. All my friends play for Keatsham so um it was quite nice to get the, the winner and I like being back here, so yeah, I was just glad to get on the score sheet for once anyway. And now you're in the semi-finals. Obviously, we don't know at this moment in time who the other teams are through in, in the last four, but presumably a home draw is the, mm -hmm. a, a home game for a change. Yeah, would be nice. so we played 17 games, I think, and had 13 away, mm. so a home draw would be nice, but if we have to go away, we have to go away. I think we've done well to go away and win and get pick up points and in the league and then to come into the cup and fight out games like we have because it's harder away from home because of travelling and everything. The girls travelled three hours today or something. So I think I'd like a home draw, yeah, <laughs> for once. It might save the petrol anyway. Well, overall, you, you, you've obviously stepped up to a higher level. You've played so many away games, as you said. Third in the table, though, it, it seems doing really well, isn't it, overall? You're you doing better or, or as well as you expected? I think we always wanted to push. We didn't want to just get promoted and just sit in the mid-table. I think Jonathan's always told us that he wants us to go for it and go for it. So... Um, we're third now, but I think if we win all our games, we go second and we really push Blackburn. We've got to play them twice, so no one knows what's going to happen. And Middlesbrough again, so hopefully we can just keep the momentum going. It's a shame the Christmas break's come for us, really, because we had gained a bit of momentum. But um, hopefully January will come, we'll get everyone back from because from, we had a lot of injuries. So hopefully we can regroup and, and push on and really challenge for the title. Overall, it's a young side, isn't it? You play good football, you gel well together. It's a team that's really sort of grown up together, isn't it? Yeah, definitely. There's a lot of girls that have come through the centre. Um, it's about three or four playing today, and like Sophie, Charlotte. So they've, they've all played together before, and I think um, they do bring a youth element to it. Sophie's so fast and quick, she can run for 120 minutes. <laughs> I can't. Um, but yeah, it's, it's quite nice that, that they just they have no fear, really. The youngsters, they just go for it. And, and overall, how much are you enjoying it here at Leicester? Yeah, I love it. It's really good. I like, the girls are really good. I, I get on with them really well. And then it's just, I, I like playing football. And here I'm playing every week, so at the minute. So, <laughs> um, yeah, I'm really enjoying it. Who knows? I'm not going to tempt fate too much, but uh, cup final and possible <laughs> major trophy on the way. The club's never <laughs> been to a major final before. No, we haven't. It would be lovely, but I'm not going to tempt fate. So just take each game as it goes. So next game we'll, we'll hope to, hopefully win. And then if the final comes, the final comes. But... <laughs> We'll just hopefully win the next one. And a good week or weekend all round for Leicester. Yeah, definitely, <laughs> with the men doing well. So I didn't expect them to beat Man City at all. So, yeah, good all round. Well, well done today, Sean. Congratulations on scoring the winning goal. Nice to see you back in the West Country, back here again. You wish you the very best of luck in the next round, whoever you draw, and in the league as well. And thanks for taking the time and talking. Like I see a cold in this weather here. <laughs> <Sorry>. <laughs> thanks Thank a lot. Thank you. Thanks.